you a planner supplies haul including some storage solutions as you can see and all these are from Michaels except for the contents inside these two bins and the reason why I decided to film this video is because um, I wanted to give you guys some inspiration on what you can do to make your life way more organized where to store your squishies you know stuff like that and there's a lot of stuff to go over so let's get started Alright, let's start off with the bins. So this one here is the big bin and I love it so much. It's very aesthetically pleasing. I like that it's clear because you can see what's in here. And yeah. <laughs> oh, also let me show you what it looks like on the inside. And by the way, this just has all of my licensed squishies from Claire's. So what's cool about this is that the top it's removable and I love how there's so many compartments at the top because that's where I can store all of my small squishies or even squishies that I play with a lot like the Pusheen ones. I also have an empty one but I think I'm gonna use this for like the rest of my squishies because I still have a lot so these two can be like my squishy bins. <laughs> Oh, and let me mention that these bins go on sale for 50% off once in a while, and actually this weekend for President's Day, it's going to go on sale again, and I just wanted to relay this information to you guys, because I know that a lot of you want to get more organized, and trust me, your mom will appreciate it. <laughs> also, no, I'm not sponsored by Michaels. Okay, here's another idea for these bins. You can use the small ones for your pop sockets. So, I did use my caboodle to store my pop sockets, but obviously my collection's growing, so I decided to switch it over to this really cute pink bin and for the small bins it does have the same top compartment I'm just gonna use these three small slots for you know loose pop sockets that don't have the packaging and on this side I just use it to store you know all the um, Swarovski crystal ones and you know just special ones to me I also have this mint topped colored bin and I can't wait to show you what's in here because it's going to store all of my planner supplies since I already have a caboodle for my bullet journal and if you didn't know I'm literally obsessed with cute stationery. But before we get into this let me show you the rest of the things that I picked up at Michael's. Alright so here are the things that I got at Michael's. These here are planner inserts and let me show you these three first. So they're planner booklets. You don't put the whole thing inside. Um, you tear out some of the pages and put it in. This one here says inspiration and um, on the inside it has like reasons to be happy, excited, thoughtful, energized, what I learned this month and you know all that stuff. Um, this one here says always be extraordinary and it has some like sections for notes. The last one says I'm too busy and it has like grid paper which is perfect for bullet journaling. So again these are like personal planner sized and here's what a personal planner looks like. And this one here is my mom's for example. Um, no you don't have to get like a really expensive Louis Vuitton one. I hope to inherit this one day though. <laughs> um, so she can just like put it inside as you can see and it would fit. Oh, and also here's a dashboard, and we got a couple of dashboards as well. They're personal size too. This one here is really pretty because it's like gold, white, and black, which is like um, my mom's favorite colors. <laughs> and this really cute pastel and gold one. So that's pretty cool, and you can just, you know, put it right here. <laughs> oh, and then we also got another personal size planner, like, calendar pack. She already has one in here as you can see, but we just got an extra one and I actually have a personal size planner. I haven't used it yet, so maybe I can just save this for next year because it doesn't have like any dates on it. You put in the dates yourself, so yeah, we can just stack up on it for next year. And here's mine. This is like the regular A5 size and let me compare it to my mom's personal size planner. Hers is a little bit small. <laughs> and let me just show you the inside. I'm not done with the setup yet. That's why I haven't done that video. But it's coming soon, so stay tuned. And let me show you. At the end here, I have all my bullet journal pages. So I'm glad I have that. 
Oh, and I also have these really cute stickers and they fit inside like the calendar boxes. So I can't wait to use these. Next thing that I picked up is one of my favorite finds. I got this kawaii paper pad. I've never seen anything like this at Michael's and you guys, cute paper pads, they don't last long at Michael's. So I'm very glad that I got this and the pages are so kawaii. If you didn't know, I love anything cute, like I said. And let me just show you a flip through of all the pages. So first we have this strawberry one and then this one says kawaii queen. Ooh, there's like these stars. And I just love everything about this. Oh my gosh! Do you see the sushi? This one's actually my favorite. I absolutely love this unicorn one, and especially like all the sweets on here because they're unicorns too. Okay, and let me show you another one of my favorites. This dog one. Isn't he or she so adorable? <laughs> I love it. Oh, and then we have some really cute hearts. And everything about this paper pad is just so adorable. I'm seriously obsessed with this paper pad and it totally reflects my art style because if you didn't know, I love to draw and my art style is like kawaii. And speaking of art, let me show you some of my drawings. So I draw on my iPad Pro with the Apple Pencil and here's the first one that I drew. It's really cute. I kind of went a little bit overboard with the doodles, but I'm very proud of it. And let me show you another one. This one here is my favorite. It's so kawaii, you guys. I love the colors in the background too. I printed this out actually, so here it is. Oh, and let me know in the comments down below if you'd like to see a tutorial or like a time lapse. I do have a screen recording of me drawing, so again, just let me know in the comments. All right, now I'm gonna show you the contents inside this bin. So, the top compartment comes out like this and there's three sections and they're perfect for storing washi tape. Um, these are just washi tapes that I've had for a while now and they're by Wonton in a Million. It's so cute. I'll talk about them more later. And then I also have my Charmer Charms because I'm planning on turning them into planner charms that dangle across the planner. So, I'm not gonna go over all of them, but here's my favorite, it's a Panda Cupcake. All right, now on to the stuff that I'm super excited about. So Wonton in a Million is actually a collection at Michael's right now, and here it is. So this one is a planner chime, and it has a pork bun character on it. So the person who designs the, um, you know, dumpling characters, her name is Cynthia Ku. And you guys, like when I walked into Michael's and saw these, I was like, I need to have this. So I got a lot of wonton and a million stuff. <laughs> um, I love how it's a squishy, you guys. And again, it's adorable. Okay, so I got three washi tape packs. This one here is actually my favorite because it has macaroons and the pork bun character. It's like adorable and very colorful so I can't wait to use this and then this one here has like um wonton and a million characters like you know with hearts and stuff this one says you're wonton in a million and you're bundiful get it bundiful <laughs> Ooh, this one's my favorite actually because it's like really colorful and it has a lot of pastel colors this is like a party themed washi tape set you know <laughs> Okay, and then I have these really cute magnetic bookmarks. You don't necessarily have to use this for books. You can even use it for like your textbooks or even for sectioning out your planner. So again, can't wait to use these. I love the pastel combination with the gold foiling. It's really pretty. I also picked up some enamel pins. I love these so much because you can put it on like a varsity jacket or even a backpack. And these two characters are really adorable. So the pork bun is holding a like little planner too. And then this one says, you're bendable. <laughs> Okay, and then I got this really cute card and envelope set. It's so adorable, you guys. And there's four different themes, but this is um, very good to have on hand just in case, you know, you forget your friend's birthday or you need to write a thank you card and you don't have time to get, like, a card. So this is perfect. And the four themes are birthday, besties, um, a thank you card, and you're on a roll, which is so adorable. And on the back it shows you right here. Oh, and then I also got these sticky notes, and this is perfect for like your planner because this can be used as a dashboard. You just need to, you know, hole punch it. And it's so adorable. I love all the characters on it. It's very kawaii too, and this is going to be very helpful. Okay, and then I got 
more sticker pads. <laughs> this one here is a weekly sticker kit and it's just for, you know, all the weeks and stuff. This one has really cute, like, dessert stickers and I like how it says, life is short, eat dessert first. <laughs> Okay, and this one has all of the, you know, days as well. I like how this sticker here can fit on like an A5 um, calendar. You can use it for, you know, writing what you need to do. And let me just show you a flip through. Okay, this last one here is actually for my mom because it has like save money, savings, you know, just bills and stuff like that. And obviously I don't need it because I don't have any bills. <laughs> It's so cute too. Okay, and that's all the wonton and a million stuff that I got. But I got some more things because in that section where the wonton and a million stuff is, there just so happens to be another collection. So this one here is called Kawaii, uh, well actually Sweet Kawaii Design and it's so cute. It definitely caught my eye because of the panda, you guys. So this is a sticker book and it has like a ton of cute stickers on it. This is perfect because I actually have like a lot of chores. Um, well, not a lot, but like, you know, there's a lot of things that I wanna get done. So it has some chores stickers on here. This one here has like a to-do list type of thing and more chores. <laughs> it's so cute, you guys. And the same collection has a planner charm. It has a unicorn birthday cake and donut. So adorable. Okay, the last few things that I got are by Shine Sticker Studio. This here is like a um, pocket type of thing that you can put inside your bullet journal or your planner or even a traveler's notebook. And it's really good to have just in case you want to save anything and just put it in here like receipts or even concert tickets. That's pretty cool. And on the back here it shows you all the pockets that comes with it. There's a unicorn, a donut, like a confetti type themed, um, and... <laughs> okay, last but not least, I got this weekly sticker kit and I got this because um, my bullet journal and planner is actually like a holographic unicorn theme. So this is perfect to use for like, you know, my March spread. Stay tuned for that. <laughs> I love it so much. The unicorns are really cute and the colors with the holographic is really pretty as well. Here's a flip through. It totally coordinates with my planner and let me just open it to show you guys as you can see it has really pretty pastel colors and it's holographic all right that's pretty much it i hope you guys enjoyed this video and also if i were you i would hurry up and go to michael's because these collections they don't last forever because um, they always change it like seasonally that's what i noticed about michael's and i'll link it to wonton and a million's website in the description again i'm not sponsored by any of these brands and i just wanted to tell you guys about the bins because i thought that it'd be helpful and it'll probably make your life way more organized and if you didn't see any of my previous videos please leave me some comments or i mean questions in the comments down below because i'm planning on doing my q a 1 million subscriber special video again let me know in the comments if if you'd like to see a squishy collection i know you've been wanting to see my planner and bullet journal setup that's coming pretty soon so make sure you stay tuned don't forget to like subscribe turn on post notifications so you won't miss any videos from me and to be a part of the hashtag jg squad i'll see you guys later bye